Okay. Guys, you've had a parcel arrive today. What do you reckon? So, my dogs regularly eat natural treats several times a week. We usually get them from local country stores, a few other places. But I decided to have a go this week at ordering from Tucker & Co. So we have ordered a 70 treat box, which was 30 pounds. Let's open it up and see what we've got in here. Okay, it's been sent by track delivery. Inside. Knife safely out way. Okay. Otie is my more food motivated dog. Merlin loves all sorts of sweeties, but he hasn't actually realised what's going on. Right, mixed variety treat box. 72 pieces, 30 pounds, and, oh, only one yak bar's arrived. Okay, so that's fine. We'll obviously be waiting on the second one. Let's have a look. Now, having a look in, we've got some nice quality products. It's a really nice ear. Really nice bit of tendon. Yep. Yeah, we've got some nice stuff in there, actually. There's quite a variety. Hold on, little ones. Hold on. Good boys and girls. The only thing I found, I was going to try and put my own box together, but they were out of quite a lot of things that I wanted to do that, it that way. This mixed box looks absolutely great, and we'll keep them going for a fair while. We've got plenty of rabbit's ears here. Um... Puff chicken's feet. Apparently there's one snout in here, which is fine because I've got one snout waiting in the cupboard. I can't see the snout. Oh, hold on. Good girl. Off your head, darling. Two seconds. Off. I know. I know it's hard to wait. Well done, guys. Right, while I'm having a look through the box, I think Merlin... We better let them have a rabbit's ear each. One of their favourites. So there we go. You've got two very happy puppy dogs. I'm not quite sure that everything is in there as described, but we do have a really nice variety. I'd have liked to see a few things more trouble for longer. I can't see pig snout in there. And as I was saying, a pick your own box would be good for me because it would be good to be able to make sure I've got even amounts of treats because these two do like to have the same thing. Right. Yeah, I'm really pleased with that. It isn't quite as I expected. The yak bar was on offer. That is small. That was down as an eight ninety nine one reduced to four pounds something. Okay, that would usually be four pounds ninety nine in the local pet shop anyway. So that's not a reduction. And at the moment I've only got one of them. So I need to wait for the other one to arrive. The field hooves look good. Have I got two of those? Will that keep them busy this evening? No, but it's okay, I've got one hoof in the cupboard. So, all in all, if you have one dog, this is an absolutely brilliant option. If you've got two dogs like I have, it's a little bit trickier. Um, I would like more options to be able to make the box even. It is pick and choose. 
the actual chewable, the sort of heavy, long-lasting chewable box wasn't for me, mainly because of the deer leg. Um, but if I could go for a box which had more of the ears, the plaits, the braids, long-lasting shoes in, leave it, monkey, monkey. Someone's very keen. Then that is probably what I would go for. But as you can see, they're going to thoroughly enjoy this. I'm going to give one filled hoof to one of them, grab the other one out of the cupboard, and that will keep them entertained for the evening. We've had a long day, and I want to relax for a bit. So yeah, nice looking items, nice box, 30 pounds. I'm happy. It's got everything, nice selection, like I say. It would just be nice to be able to choose my, choose my own. <sighs> Things like the pig snout, if it's out of stock, please say so. And say that you're not going to put it in the box. But yeah, there we go. All in all, pleased with what's arrived from Tucker & Co. And I think these two are going to enjoy a bit more this evening. So there we go. See you again soon, guys. And we're going to go and do some chewing.